Hi Jeff, I got a little show and tell for you here. If you'll just bear with me a little bit. I'll try to explain to you what I, what I, I'm not going to say difficult how time putting it on paper, but I'm afraid you might have a hard time understanding it. Because sometimes us Newton kind of get hard headed. We don't know exactly what we're doing. But I'm just kind of giving you a preview of all my metal art my cousin did before I start doing anything. What the purpose of this is, is to explain to you what my opinion is in my, my limited knowledge of fabrication in the years that I've done such as that. And, but I'm concerned about the vacuum cylinder in the way that we've got it drawn. Uh, I feel like it's going to have to be made in three pieces. This right here is a full-size pattern of the outer wall that I'm talking about. And of course, this right here is a picture of the inner wall. That, that's, a, that's the inner wall pattern. Of course, that'll roll up into a cone. And this right here is rolled up, rolled into a cone or a reducer, if you will. We call it in the fabrication field. You see it's bigger on one end than it is on the other end, just like the vacuum cylinder is. And of course this is the inner wall. And I've already put the, see we're going to have a spacer, a one-eighth spacer in between those walls. Like I said, I, I just feel like it's gonna have to be done in three pieces. This represents the one-eighth spacer, which that is one-eighth of an inch in diameter. And I'm showing this inner wall with that spacer already attached. You see that that's one-eighth spacer right there. Of course, down at the bottom also. You take that and you tack that, tack well that onto your inner wall. Then you take your outer wall. Of course, this is the outer wall again. And you take this and put it inside this. Then you weld this around here. All three of those pieces can be welded at one time. All the way around, same thing on the bottom. Again, this, that's just, just my feeble attempt to explain to you what I'm talking about. I, I can draw it and I have drawn it to show it in three pieces rather than the single piece that we're showing on the drawing. I just, I, then of course this is gonna have to have another spacer going over to the inner vessel spacing that off an eighth of an inch also or I think we call it a sixteenth but anyway you get the gist of what I'm talking about uh, again I'm just explain, trying to explain to you my feelings and, and my thinking on it and I hope you understand what I'm talking about Again, that's, that's the full-size pattern of the inner wall, and that's the full-size pattern of the outer wall. There's the inner wall, and there's the outer wall rolled up. And of course, this is, again, the spacer that's going to be required. Got any questions, give us, let's talk. Bye.